I, I first heard about my book being in Tiger Woods' car when I got a couple of emails from friends in the States um, with pictures attached from the sheriff's office showing it lying amongst the bits of broken glass. Uh, I thought, well, this is a weird thing for a golfer to be interested in. There's been some uh, tongue-in-cheek suggestions. I mean, the, the fact that it's called Get a Grip, you know, leads people to think maybe he thought it was about improving his golf swing. Uh, but if you think about it, I mean, he's a, a busy man. He spends a lot of time on aeroplanes. And like everyone else, he's probably heard stories about the Large Hadron Collider and the Big Bang and so on, and thought, well, I'd like to know more about it. Uh, and of course, if he'd read the book properly, he'd know that you can't drive a car into a fire hydrant and expect to get off scot-free. Um, but no, I think, I think it probably is genuine interest in physics and that's great news if, if someone like him is reading physics, so, so be it. it. It's very strange really because it's, it's great to have some publicity but I wish it had been for a book that was still in print. I mean this one, um, the story goes, it shot up the Amazon bestseller list. Well it, it did because they only had about a hundred copies and they sold them all in a day. I won't get rich on this one. I'm, I'm, I've got a plan though. I'm, I'm hoping to send Tiger a copy of my new book and ask him to leave it lying around somewhere to be photographed.